Wagwan guys, not long ago, earlier this year, Upwork actually hit us with their summer update for 2025 and it was actually published in July 2025, around, um, I think on 23 or thereabout. Some of these updates are actually quite helpful and others are actually just getting some freelancers wonder if Upwork is trying to make life easier for us or other. A small tweak here could quietly boost how we pull in steady work on Upwork without burning connect like carpet crew in Lagos traffic. The best part is that these updates may nudge out on serious freelancers that are spamming proposals in the long run and clear spaces for guys like you investing in leveling up your skills, leveling up your knowledge of Upwork, sending quality proposals. So let's run through the major core of the updates that Upwork made in 2025. Are you ready? Are you ready? Let's go! The first one is instant interview via UMA. Before summer 2025, applying meant only writing proposals. If you don't write proposals, you don't get job or you have to wait just for invitations and you keep hoping that oh, you will get a reply. Now, clients can actually enable a 5 to 10 minute instant interview on their job post. They set the questions that they want the AI to ask you. So when you apply, you answer and then it's recorded in the proposal flow and connect are actually only deducted when you hit that submit button. Then, Uma delivers the client an interview score based on your responses. You know, delivers a full transcript of the interview and concise summary before they can even open your cover letter or your Upwork proposal, making it easier and faster for clients to hire on Upwork. So let's talk about native video meetings. Before this summer, video calls on Upwork were via Zoom links. Um, dropped into message, you know, the message feature on Upwork and you have to scramble to record or take notes yourself. Now, with Upwork video meetings powered by Uma, you launch calls directly inside messages. You still have the option of using Zoom. It is still there. But then when you use the Upwork video feature, Uma actually handles background noise reduction, HD recording, full transcript, AI generated summaries and action steps, all auto saved in your message for up to, I think, six months. The other thing is better job feed. You know, context aware search. Before the summer update in 2025, Upwork's job tab sorted by dates, um, dates that the content is posted, or basic keyword match. So you would have to endlessly scroll and scroll and scroll, manually jump in feature for like things like budget, when you know how to use the filter for search, uh, for things like timeline, for things like payment history of the client. Now, Uma quietly scans your profile, past gigs that you have delivered on Upwork, and your proposal history. The moment you open the job field, then it actually re-ranks the listings of jobs so that the gigs you are are most likely to land are the ones you see. They are the ones that bubble to the top. Plus, it actually suggests your optimal budget range kind of project. So if you are applying for low budget range project, that's the kind of project it will suggest to you more. Do you understand? And um, it also try to um, figure out the kind of client payment history you've had and your filters, you understand? So another thing that I find fascinating about um, Upwork Update is the real-time job alert for Freelancer Plus. Before the summer 2025, saved searches alert actually arrives as daily or weekly email digest. By the time you saw them, the best gigs are actually gone. Other people have applied for them and gotten the gigs. Now, Freelancer Plus members get real-time notification via email, mobile push notification, the moment the job matches their filter and past proposals. So, basic users stay on the slower daily or weekly digest cycle. If you want first dips, plus is the move. Do you understand? So now let's also talk about the UMA powered proposal insight. You know, before the summer 2025, writing proposals felt like shooting arrows in the dark. You're just guessing for most freelancers. You camped up keywords, you list your skills and hope for the best. Now, Freelancer Plus subscribers get real-time proposal insight. That is, Upwork is telling you, although like I've used it and uh, I, I, I don't really find it as fascinating as it sounds theoretically, but yeah, it's useful because you can get Upwork's feedback 
for the proposal you write. But don't forget that getting that feedback is also from an AI, from Uma AI. Do you understand? Versus you, human. So I think what beats the AI and um, attracts clients more is the more human you can be. So like, yeah, why that um, review by an AI of your proposal works, um, it, it should also be used with caution. Do you understand? So I like most, I have uh, maybe like keywords you've missed, like that, those are the kind of things that the AI is going to flag for you. It flags your top skill matches and even gives a competitiveness score before you eat send. On the flip side, Business Plus client actually received AI created shortlist surfacing the top proposals first. It's gated behind premium plans and rolling out gradually, but once you've got it, every word you type, it's other. These are the major ones that I noticed that you need to know. I will actually see you in the next video. I trust that you're going to click on this or this. <laughs> I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.